One month ago today, a Richmond police officer was shot in the line of duty. Officer Daniel Ellis died two days later. Since the shooting, people and businesses in Richmond have been showing their support for his wife and young son. Tonight, the city honored Katie and Luke Ellis by naming them the Grand Marshals of the Richmond Christmas Parade. Monique Blair has the story. It was a night to kick off the holiday season. A night to wish good cheer to others. But for many people in this crowd, they are. Friday night was a night to honor Officer Daniel Ellis's wife, Katie, and son, Luke, as they served as the Grand Marshals of the annual Richmond Parade. I love you guys. It was a very powerful moment. This is uh, the student commandant on horse-drawn carriage. As the horse and carriage brought Katie and Luke by the courthouse here, they were welcomed by a sea of blue glow sticks. Just another way the community is showing support for the Ellis family. Just for her, just so she knows that we still care. And as Katie and Luke waved, I think it's something I'll for, never forget. The crowd of thousands waved back to show them they are not alone. Usually tragedies do two things, either pull a community apart or bring it together. And I think, you know, taking a look at other communities, this definitely has brought Richmond together. In Richmond, in Monique Blair for the Fox 56 10 o'clock news. The Richmond Christmas Parade has been a tradition for more than 30 years, and each year a person who is special to the community is chosen, chosen to serve as the Grand Marshal.